we go. I tell you, separate ways hits different when you know who's about to walk out that curtain. The best to ever do it across any country, any continent. That is the bulldozer, Matt Tremont, and he has his eyes on the prize. And it just happens to be the American Deathmatch Championship. I gotta stand up for this one. I'm fired the fuck up. Maddie with the camo on, ready for war. And you gotta think, this this isn't the first time that Casey and Matt are meeting with each other, but it never happened in the chains. It's a whole different environment. 100% a different environment. Here comes the champ. There she is. The love of my fucking life. For now. <laughs> Look at the fucking swagger. The swagger of the American Deathmatch World Champion who climbed that mountain and earned that title, but also the swagger of a young lady who has a six foot 10 monster willing to do whatever the fuck she wants. Yeah, I, I'm aware, thank you. on the face of the earth is a motivated, a focused bulldozer, Matt Tremont. I've experienced that.
fucking right. And that's the other side of the coin. You have an extremely focused Matt Tremont across from you, but look at the confidence he's leading from Casey right yeah. now. You haven't seen this before from her. No, no, you haven't. We're seeing it here now. Rocket strapped to the back. Not running out of gas anytime soon. A deathmatch fantasy turned to reality. Unfuckwithable Casey Kirk against the bulldozer Matt Tremont. There's the bell, and here we go. Main event time at NHB 35. House is split 50-50 right now. That just comes with the territory when you stand across the ring from Matt Tremont. We can get on the same page with that. Look at the fire in the eyes right there. The focus. focus. I think she knows this is probably going to be her hardest test yet. She's been through some shit. You know. Yeah. First hand. We know. She is not backing down from Matt Tremont. Hey, that confidence comes with experience and she's paid for it in blood. Flurious strikes. Forearm strike right on the jaw. Oh my, oh my god. One of the best right hands in professional wrestling. Heads up. Uh, Holy shit! Fast ball down the middle, right to the face of Tremont. Ooh, puts on the brakes. Oh, that smile! Oh! Open field tackle through that pane of glass! Hit her head on that turnbuckle right now. And Matt Tremont's fired the fuck up. Uh, this, this does not bode well. It's like Matt saw his own blood and decided the games were over. The stare downs and pleasantries out the window. Right away, wasted no time, Matt, grabbing that gusset plate. No! And you hear the screams. And Matt calling his shot. I don't know, it's going to take a lot more than that to keep the champ down. We know it. She's known to weather the storm. She's known that once the glass starts flying, that's when she starts to turn it up. Shades of, uh, as you can maybe say, the king of the deathmatch, Eric sure. Ryan. She has that switch, and once it's flipped, it's, a wrap. it's fucking over. Yeah. Honestly, I mean, actions aside, as of late, she's the closest thing I've ever seen to Megumi Kudo, and, and it's fucking scary yes. in the best way possible. But, man, just... If you get if you get on the bad side, if you if you have her mentality cross over to that dark place, it's over for you. As he just grinds those tacks into the fucking forehead. Oh uh. no! <laughs> the 
just, that can't be fun. Those tacks to the top of the head? No. <laughs> a little of the metal spikes going into your head. Methodical pace from the bulldozer. Backdrop right to Casey. That might, that might be it. Not enough to put the champion away. And look at the thumbtacks just sticking out of the top of her head. And that blood's starting to trickle down. Like, as a competitor right now, do you, do you try and pull those out or you don't even notice? I, I, honestly, that adrenaline's running so much, That's you don't fair. even notice. You feel them going in. Of course. Obviously, bigger problems as Matt Tremont starts to stalk Casey Kirk. Big headbutt, pops that tube. And it's been all Tremont right from the get-go. Yeah. She stood up to him, though. You saw the defiance. You saw yeah. the swagger. Went in with that flurry of strikes. But since that, man, not much offense. Matt almost looks reluctant. I mean, the man has a heart. Of course he does. We know. And it's, no, it's no secret that Matt Tremont is a friend of the Kirk family. Matt has a lot of love and a lot of respect for Casey. He doesn't want to do this. Of course. But there's one thing standing in between them, and that's the American Deathmatch Championship. And we will do some shitty fucking things for gold. 100%. You got to understand, this is the battleground. This is the competition. And when it's game time and when the bell rings, all that shit go, it goes out the window. No friends when you step in between the chains. You know, you want to be great? You want to be one of the best ever? You got to cross this bridge. And guess what? It's not fucking fun. Oh, just carving up her forehead right now. You see her picking out those tacks. Man, those are not small, those tubes. You might even call them big. Yes, the technical term. As you see the blood streaming down the face of Matt Tremont as he got his eyes on the prize. Another back suplex, maybe? Oh, yes, God. sir! Casey is down and out. That Hooks could the be leg. Big. You can see Matt starting to just get a little bit more frustrated. But that's the name of the game. We've seen it. We've seen Casey's rise, her journey. She's able to weather the storm, and it frustrates and gasses out her opponent, and then she's able to take the upper hand. Matt knows. Matt's been here before. But well, that doesn't mean you can combat this. There's no game plan for this. I don't know. It's going to take a lot for the bulldozer to run out of gas right now. He's been in control of this entire match. Yeah, 100%. And you see him picking, up, picking her apart, shot to the leg. If that leg is not fun, functioning, then you're not getting up to the platform. You're not hitting the 187. You're not hitting that low fly cross body. There's a lot of things that come with a, a damaged limb like that. And look at him calling his shot, saying just another accomplishment for the bulldozer. That's a bold fucking statement. Going for a third back suplex. Casey finally starting to fire back, showing a little bit of life. Rapid fire strikes. That's it. Leaves him reeling. Now here is when the unfuck withable shines. Oh, oh huge right four. Oh, rapid fire headbutts. Sending him into the corner. Popping that tube up in a prone position. Another forearm strike. Picks that tube up. Placing it in position. There it is. 
And you gotta remember, even with not connecting on that glass the first time, three or four flush forearms landed on the jaw. Sitting Fremont down in the corner now, grabbing some more tubes to lay across his chest. Could be going for that corner splash. I don't that low know bridge, what low bridge splash that she does. Oh my low god! Flying cross body! Hooks the leg! Not enough to put down the bulldozer. You hear that frustration? Blowing Matt in, has something in mind. Oh, Matt's Up got her shoulders! DVD! What the fuck, God. man? Fucking damn it! <sighs> Did you know about this? No, I don't fucking know about anything. What the fuck is he doing out here? Casey on the back. And she's got that choke locked in. We've seen Cruel put people away with that same exact choke. Hooks in. He says he's out. Holy shit. What the fuck is going on? She just choked out the bulldozer. Excuse me? Like, somebody's got to fucking stop this, man. Like, that's a woman who will do anything and everything to protect that title, including disrespect her fucking husband like that. Makes me sick to my stomach. Is that belt that important to you? That you need to manipulate this fucking monster? Fucking disgusting.